All right, so as I start this reading, I will say this. I don't care who you are. If you are hacking my phone, my electronics, illegally spying on me to take my spiritual gifts, what I do spiritually for money to help, you're using it and you're manipulating it, I'm going to ask my ancestors to come knocking on your fucking door and bringing all my shit back. And they come. Just how they y'all didn't try to send shit my way and they asked and got sent motherfucking right back. They don't bother me. They don't fuck with me. And y'all see that? Y'all know that. My answers answers are those. Let me tell you something. They're gonna go going through your shit. They're gonna get my shit back. And I mean that. Cause y'all like to watch me take my shit and then shadow ban me. Pay attention to what's gonna fucking happen to you if you're doing that shit. Pay attention. <laughs> it's not as best to shut the fuck up because you are the goat. Hello. <laughs> Expect the blessing. I don't give a fuck. I ain't saying nothing. I'm tired of um, these people. Self-care, true love, talk to God sometimes, Libra, the test. It gets wilder, you're a trick, or keep pulling. You're being divinely guided, create the life that you want in traffic, don't trust it. Healing. Let me find out if the Libra is hacking me. I'm sorry, because I just know I get that feeling sometimes. He, he'll mess up your pH balance, they reroute your server connection to be able to stalk you or pose as you. Um... Cause I get, I know what I feel, and child, I will go fucking hell. I'll go fucking hell because they stealing from me. They're fucking with the everything, and I'm, I'm not a stealer. That's what I don't do. Excuse me, I had to blow my nose, my sinuses. Well, they ask about me. You never don't steal. Do I know people that everybody knows somebody that do a little bit of everything? A little bit of everything. Everybody do. You will be a fucking lie. The president is the president of the United States say they don't. You're a fucking lie because you're one of them and you work with them. The fucking whole world. The, the, this, this, this country is a corporation. That's everything that needs to be done. That's, that shows everything. That tells everything. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so, even you know some people, right? That don't mean you are. But let's keep going. Do it right in front of our faces and our eyes all day, every day. <laughs> Which I just got the privilege to get away with it. I'm not talking shit about these people. I mean, I'm just saying. Because people be trying to make it seem like um, otherwise. Okay, but for some of you guys, you could be taking this situation a little wrong, too. Yes, somebody is watching you. Yes, somebody did hack you, okay? But there's somebody else in the background that is trying to help you. Stop ignoring the red flags. Because there's something going on that you don't see. When it comes to these people watching you and stalking you, somebody trying to help you with that too. So pay attention. You got some hidden helpers telling you and showing you something, whether it be spiritually or whether it be actual people that was working with this person that was hacking you and stalking you. Some of you guys, this person is lying and saying that they want to marry you or they're married to you to do what they're doing. That is some weird ass shit. Like yesterday, all yesterday, I felt my phone being washed and hacked. And then I heard some weird shit from somebody's mouth around me. And I'm like, yeah, you are fucking creep ass bitch. You are pervert. I don't give a fuck. You feel me? I don't give a fuck. It was weird as fuck. Like, yeah, no. Community imprisonment. Like, this community could even be imprisonment for helping this person watch you and stalk you. I know I got a group of people watching me, stalking me, and they can not they can say what they want to say, and they all creeps and perverts to me, and that's all my soul. That's all my motherfucking kid's life, and I mean that. <laughs> I don't feel no way about that, calling y'all some creeps or some perverts who watching my phone, hacking me illegally. I don't feel no way. What, to see if my gift was real? Bitch, bye. You not God. God know what the fuck is up. You feel me? Yeah, I, don't, I ain't never did no shit like that. Man, I'm so sorry. Let's get back to this reading. Let's get back to this reading. What is the background and surrounding energy of this reading? I'm always having a rant, but it be for a reason. <laughs> be for a reason. I don't just talk shit to talk it. Hey, man. Time for somebody to analyze the situation from a different perspective and start investing in yourself. Wow. 
pay attention to what this King of Pentacles has been doing. This King of Pentacles has been planting seeds on you as you, posing as you. King of Pentacles in reverse has been doing badness, bad business, possibly as you. It's time for you to see. This ain't no lovey-dovey situation. They could even be trying to say they're trying to help you. They are stealing from you. Like I said, being done with me. It ain't no helping. It ain't no protecting. Bitch, you stealing from me. Somebody could have a wife that's stealing for them, helping them. Could be a Cancer, could be a Libra Taurus. Baby mama something to do bad business. They lying and saying they helping you. They working with you, but they're not. Somebody not. What's up with this background surrounding energy? Let's start with this. What's this background surrounding energy? Going back to somebody could be saying like they're your manager, accountant, all this weird ass shit. Bitch, you a one one woman show. Courthouse. It's time to take the motherfuckers to court because you is the official person. Somebody else could even took your fucking privilege from you. Made you you could be you supposed to be a privileged lady, but somebody is living in poverty as you. Somebody has somebody hacking their phone electronics their whole life. They could even be physically following you on foot, watching you. I know for a fact last week i i seen this one i wanted to hop out and ask this bitch why the fuck you keep standing behind my car trying to take pictures of my shit bitch i see you she almost got her ass let me tell y'all something bitch and you know who you are because you had on gray you had on gray sweats when i was going to get the motherfucking wings bitch I'm watching her through my side mirrors. I'm not saying nothing, but I'm like, and then you can tell when people is on the phone and how they talking, because I could have sworn I seen this bitch twice before. And I don't care if she's somebody mama. Tell your mama to stop following me. Because I'm a grown-ass woman. She was grown, too. Y'all. On the phone talking, then it looking like you ain't even waiting for no food because I didn't watch your every move. You ain't even went into nowhere. You're watching me. Y'all, they probably got people even watching you on foot, taking pictures of you, doing the most. Somebody is also living your life through your phone and your camera. Okay? It's time to take their ass to court and sue these bitches. They've been stealing a lot from you, especially if you use your phone for business, for work. Whatever it is that you do, okay, and you keep your shit in your phone, they have been making money off of that shit. I mean, some of you guys, these people have done the most that went to your family and got your family in cahoots with you. They done went to people and they're working with your phone company, acting like they're authorized people on your account to get in shit, to watch shit. This is the shit that I'm talking about. It's people always talking about calling people snitches and feds, but they out here doing fed work. It's the, the fake feds, the hood feds. And there always be them people coming out of prison and jail and knowing people and, oh, you a snitch, you a this, and trying to take people out because you're going to expose my business. You're going to tell people that I'm fucking on little ass kids. But yet you're doing fed work, nigga. Make that make sense. Shut your ass up. You might as well go ahead and be a fucking fed. That shit be baffling me. Excuse my language, but let's keep going. What's going on? Well, it took a while for somebody to see that this person was doing bad business pertaining to you. What is this? Two of Pentacles? Yeah, somebody trying to balance this shit out. Trying to juggle, trying to figure out what they're going to do. But ain't nothing they can do but surrender, hang man, in the mental entrapment, not knowing what to do, where to go, feeling a little paranoid. This cycle has came to a completion. It's a fucking wrap. Look, sitting there waiting. What the fuck I'm going to do? Where I'm going to go? What's going to happen? What's this two of pentacles? Hey, you got to walk your ass away. That's what the fuck you need to do. Look, if somebody's ashamed and regret over the shit that they didn't did, yeah, for this ace of pentacles regarding yours, that was supposed to be coming to you. Go ahead and walk your ass away. Hello. Yeah, and let you be free, financially independent and free. Look, the secrets is out. 
The secret is out. You deserve this pay, y'all, or whatever that it was that they was taking from you. The secret is out. At first, it was no secrets. Everybody acted like they didn't know what was going on, but they was watching. They ain't said nothing. Somebody about to say something. This was all illegally unjustified off balance. Look, four of wands, dealing with a marriage or a commitment. These people could even say they lived with you. They was working with you. We together. That's the fucking lie. Page of cups in reverse. That's the fucking lie. Somebody wasn't using their intuition. It's going to get exposed. The sun. Somebody's going to be able to release this stressful situation. King of wands. Knight of wands. Four of cups. The higher fit. What the fuck is this? Oh, yeah. There's going to be a stop or ending to something. This marriage. This commitment. It's something going on that you don't know about. Hmm. I was being done behind your back, and it's about to be a hope to that. What's this two of pentacles? The hermit. So somebody's going to have to go within and do some healing, some interception, intercepts, interse <laughs> Somebody got to go figure out some things. The emperor and temperance. Somebody had to go figure out some things so they can balance themselves, get back grounded, and get in full, full control of their life. Yeah. Somebody had to go within uh, and do some introspection on. For some of you guys, this person strongly is saying that, okay, I, I need to go heal. I need to go get my shit together. They could be saying the reason why they was watching you so much is because of how much they was in love with you. But that's not true. Like, do not let this person talk love to you. This was all for pinnacles. Seven of pinnacles. King of pinnacles in reverse. Two of pinnacles. Nine of pinnacles. Eight of cups. There is no love. Eight of cups is not having any more love in the situation. They're having them walk away. In search of your nine of pentacles, your wishful fulfillment. Because this is not somebody's wishful fulfillment. They're not getting what they desire and they want out this situation at all. They need to set you free. Hello, in the public, even though it's some bad news coming, it's clear as day. The star in reverse. There is no healing to be done, getting done. Somebody needs to walk away. Yeah, somebody has somebody in a third party situation. It's time to wrap that shit up. Yeah, you were a third party. You were a side piece. This person has somebody. Justice in reverse, strength in reverse, queen of pentacles. This person was strongly using you for your money. Somebody was illegally stressing you out, trying to take your courage and your strength away from you to stop you from moving forward as well, too. It's kind of like they wanted to, you was going to keep doing all this hard work and not get any rewards out of it. Why? Because I'm going to take it all from you. As soon as you do something on your phone, we are presenting it as ours we already got somebody so you got people that waiting like if you up at five o'clock in the morning and this is when i've been real like that because when i would do my lives they would start interrupting them and then they would go live and they would be like man nobody is even up watching rings right now why do they got us um, up right now trying to do this at the same time and they will eventually all start talking y'all i will start switching my shit up right the time i wake up and do my readings when i do it because i started realizing some things I started realizing some things. Somebody realizing too, I gotta walk away. I gotta let you go because this ain't adding up. This ain't adding up. I'm not able to keep up with this. It's being shown why I did what I did and where it's coming from. Somebody is about to start some something. Somebody tried to single you out and tried to make you again. They tried to make you work real, real hard and not get any payouts for it, and any rewards. They didn't want to see you elevate, move up. And it's somebody that you look up to. This higher friend that's in reverse. And wanted you to be in this heartbroken energy. But you are this empress. They wanted to stress you the fuck out, empress. Some of you guys have got a fucking spiritual mentor. They're a bum. That you do work with and stuff. Like, literally, they just bend people futures. Whenever time they see people getting money, they do shit to them. They can't bring chaos so they can come to them and they can get a piece of their money. They're just a fucking spiritual bum and leech. That's all they are. That's all they are. They don't fucking heal. They don't put people on their journey, on their path. They calling. They don't do none of that. They just always have a handout. Every time some big money come in, they do some bullshit. And that's the truth. They're really jealous. 
they're really jealous. This person could even be into hacking and shit, okay? This person could even be abusive. For some of you guys, this is a lover of yours, okay? This is a lover of yours. They don't give a fuck about you. Y'all, anyway... Let's keep going, because this person about to piss me off. <laughs> what is this? I've been talking about this person that work in tech. Look, the devil in reverse. You got to let go of this person. I wish I worked in tech. I would not be on this motherfucking platform. Maybe I need to get into tech. Because <laughs> that's where the money at right now. You know, the secrets is out. Are you okay? Yeah. What's the devil in reverse? Ten of swords, four of pentacles. Look, holding on tightly to you. This person is also pissed off and devastated because you're reserving your energy and you holding back. You're not giving in no more. Energetically to their bullshit, their ways. You're detaching from them. You're walking away. You're setting yourself free because you know for a fact what the fuck is going on. You realize you didn't peep game on this person or these people. Some of you guys may. For me, I had to stop using my phone for a while because I realized that's where a lot of it was coming from. They was hacking my phone, and a lot of the time they hack you through people closely around you. They go tell false lies to get information about you, and then, you know. So um. Ugh. I wouldn't forgive my family. I'm going to be honest with y'all. I'll just leave. Because I would never do no shit like that. This child. Because some of y'all, the pregnant person in here, that didn't. Th when you pregnant, you're supposed to be in the best energy possible. And I ain't going to say no more. Um, I ain't going to say no more. What is this? You got another life in you. That's why. And they taking on all that energy. You feeding them a lot. But um, something about to come out about what was given, who all was donating and giving to you, sharing with you. Someone's about to share something with you. Be, get prepared. Because this person is devastated and they hurt. The truth is about to come out about how they've been holding you back. All after you hold your energy back and you withdraw from this person and you detach from their toxic ass. What's the devil in reverse? What's the devil in reverse? <laughs> Deep down inside you already know this person is abusive and they abuse their power and their authority. The emperor in reverse. So a lot that's hidden about this person. And you know it though. This person may even be unstable. They don't got their shit together. They don't have their life in order. Page of swords stalking you. What'd I say? Trying to balance out watching you and stalking you. Because they know they didn't got caught being sneaky and deceptive. Tempers in reverse. They know they didn't got caught being sneaky and deceptive. They already know. And they trying to figure out a way to juggle this. Balance this shit out. What did I say in the beginning? I know what I felt. Look, they had the help of your, your, your frenemies. People that you was rejoicing with. And you thought had your back. Because y'all was partying hard together. Y'all was just partying hard. Put you in the conflict spell by telling all them lies and manipulation. They start turning y'all against one another. Excuse me. They started turning y'all against one another. Your spirituality or upbringing is an issue with them. Get out your head. Stop creating crazy scenarios. So this is what they did about you, I feel like. They used your spirituality against you because you may not be a, like a Christian. Okay, I'm going to just use that because that's like one of the most popular religions, right? It is. Now, you was not a Christian. And they used all of that to manipulate your energy to have these people do weird shit, talk about you, and have you in this conflict spell to watch you, spy on you, see what you was doing, how you was balancing your life out, how you was making ends meet. Everything they did to you with this stalking, watching, possibly trying to set you up, doppelganging energy. You bounce back from it all because you are the magician. Somebody was trying to figure out how you balancing your life. How are you manifesting this shit? 
through healing. Hello? Oh, while they were trying to harm you. Someone could even say they were a healer. And the proof is in the pudding that they're not a fucking healer. Look, spirits are always around. Whoever you are, you a real fucking healer, though. And that's why they went so crazy at the way that they did. Trying to figure you out. Somebody was missing business with pleasure. Trying to figure you out and how you was doing what you was doing. And be patient. It actually was a blessing in disguise, though. Because I guess it actually proved people or proved to these you were the real deal. Right? Yeah, somebody was ego tripping, big headed. Take everything too personal. Somebody might need to try a new city, get away for a little bit because you know you're dealing with somebody that's pure evil. Oh, I feel like you know a lot more than what you say about these people that tried to cause these false accusations and watch you. These people could even say you was evil. Whoever you are, you loyal. Pick your head up. Yeah. You loyal and you know it. So while they over here talking shit about you, you just look inside y'all. You just looking at them like, yeah, okay. But if I was to put out what the fuck y'all really about, it's going to be some, it's going to be some shit gonna be some shit because i just seen that betrayal to you called the tower to the fucking to everybody but anyway let's see get a tune up Once you fully awake from this curse all hell is about to break loose because some of you guys they could even do spell work on you to have you to like have you overlook signs of synchronicity spell work to have you have a clouded vision and yeah, be mindful you don't push a good thing away what judgment for some of you guys because it is if somebody that's been trying to help you or going to help you about what's been going on pay attention in this part they put cameras in or around your house wow nosy as fuck always in your business a scorpio because you felt that they felt rejected by you oh wow that is sick they just don't want to see you in it or doing it. So somebody's been trying to help you regarding this situation. I'm trying to tell you some shit. Because somebody for sure, hang man, they did it to themselves. Yeah, you might need to put harassment. And then on top of that, they started harassing you? Provoking you, trying to get a reaction out of you? Something with Steven and Stealing again. Said that you with Steven and Stealing. But guess what? It exposed how sick of a fucking creep that they are. There's nothing wrong with a little reassurance. Making money off of you on the back end. I feel like there's a conflict of interest. Because there's a group of people that knows that Scorpio did this to you. And they're letting them get away with it. Because they're feeding into their sick fantasies. And yeah there's a scorpio put cameras in somebody's house yeah they are a devil in disguise they don't want to see people to see you in your true light and this is a karmic masculine they either put them in your house or around your house or they told some lies to get authorization about it or you need to because this person is sick they're already following you and watching you they stalking you everything doesn't need a reaction right now somebody's gonna let you know or you're gonna figure something out this person may even get arrested very soon Ooh, they said the, the big boys is watching. It's going to backfire. Pay attention. The big boys is watching. Because I feel like they know now. Yeah, don't follow what somebody shouldn't have. It. Don't follow the crowd. You might just get lost in it. All right? It's about to be an overthrow. It's a lot of manipulation. It's a rabbit hole right now. Jeez Louise. All right, I love you guys so much. Take care.